All right. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. Dylan, our day is finally here. In just a few hours, I'll become Chloe Shirky. I want you to know how excited and grateful I am to become your wife. <clears throat> I never imagined I would get to marry you. It still doesn't seem real. I know for a fact I'm the luckiest girl. You are the best dog dad our pups could ask for, and I know you will be an even more amazing father to our children. You have no idea how ready I am to see you. I love you more than anything, seriously. See you soon. That was tough. I don't think, I, I barely made it through that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Chloe, what a five years it's been. I truly don't know what I did to deserve you, but I'm so glad you chose me. <laughs> As I sit here writing this letter, I can't help but remember all of the special moments we've shared, from our first date at Maggie's, to traveling the Caribbean, to uprooting and moving to Jacksonville. The time we've spent together has been the best part of my life. You've taught me what it means to truly love unconditionally, <laughs> about how to live life with a free spirit, and about how to always smile even when it's hard. <laughs> Today and every day after. I need you to know that it won't always be easy, but it will always be worth it. Thank you so much for being the most authentic version of yourself. I can't wait to be your husband. <laughs> I love you most, Dylan. <laughs> oh my God, it's always so hard. <sighs> How do I fix myself? <laughs> On behalf of Chloe and Dylan, I would like to thank you all for being here this afternoon, for taking the time, making the journey, and for all the efforts it takes, not only to be part of this day, but part of each other's lives. Dylan, do you take Chloe to be your wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poor, sickness and in health, to love and cherish until death do you part? Chloe, do you take Dylan to be your husband, to have the hold from this day forward, better, worse, richer, poor, sickness and in health, to love and cherish until death do you part? You may now kiss your bride. Hey, give it up for Mr. and Mrs. Dylan Shirky. Doesn't even make sense why I think about you It was only one night, only that time And it's not my style to be caught up in the middle like this Cause now I dream about you I was probably too drunk, blurry But I've got the image of you running circles in my mind right now
So, Dylan and Chloe, you know what? What a power couple. All right. <laughs> Yo, yeah. I'm Shay. I'm Dylan's best man. Uh, a lot of people probably don't know this, but Dylan had a hard time finding the best man. <laughs> he did. He called his most successful friend, but he said no. <laughs> and he called his most intelligent friend, but he, he said no. <laughs> so he called his most attractive friend, he said no. <laughs> so then Dylan called me. <laughs> right, and he asked me, and I was like, well man, I feel like I can't tell you no four times in a row for sure. <laughs> When Dylan came into her life, I remember being confused because she was falling for a boy who was much older and more grown than her. Uh, and I feared it would push us apart. But it honestly did just the opposite. When Dylan was ready to be the big brother I always wanted, Chloe would tell me stories from Dylan talking about me and how much he cared. And that's when I knew they were the perfect fit. I can't explain how great Dylan is for Chloe. I watched them grow together and become the people they are now. And they're getting married. And I feel so honored to be with them. So congratulations and good luck to the newlyweds. But I'm gonna